didn't know you were there. Well, hello. Now we can get started. You want the truth? You can't handle the truth. We're diving right into the YouTube algorithm. What is going on with this algorithm? How can we find black YouTuber channels? We are talking all about the black experience, how black YouTubers can grow on YouTube. Can we even make it on this platform? And where is the support? All that right here. All right, let's dive in. Grab your popcorn. It is gonna be a bumpy ride. Black YouTuber channels. Enough said. There are so many amazing black YouTuber channels that you must check out. But the question is, where exactly are we finding these channels? So there's a few struggles when it comes to the black YouTuber experience. However, we're not gonna dive in just yet. Here's how you can find these black YouTuber channels. I hate to break it to you, but we may not be the first or second or even third video that pops up in your search. So what you're gonna have to do is keep on scrolling. Scroll, baby, scroll until you find the channel that you are looking for. It doesn't matter what you are searching for. Type in what you're searching for in that search bar and you will find us, but it may take some time. I love watching YouTubers of all different ethnicities. The bottom line is if it's good content, it's good content. However, I love to support our black YouTubers as well, just because I, for one, know the experience and what it's like and how it can be a little bit more challenging on the platform to stick out or for your videos just to get seen by more people. So like I said, just make sure you keep on scrolling to find more black YouTuber channels. And another thing you may not be aware of, now a lot more YouTubers use hashtags in their videos and so if a YouTuber uses a hashtag and says hashtag black YouTuber or hashtag black YouTube channel or whatever the hashtag they're using, there's a possibility you may find more black YouTubers just by looking for that hashtag and searching by that hashtag. The only downside is that then you're gonna have to literally sift through all the random videos because if you're searching hashtag black YouTuber, then it's gonna come up with any and every video that someone used that hashtag with. And so that's the only downside is that you're gonna have to do a lot of sifting and so that's not my preference, but that's just another option. My preference is just to use the search bar and just keep on scrolling until I find the content that I'm looking for. So there's so many amazing black YouTuber channels that I wanted to let you know about. So the first one is Trent Shelton and his YouTube channel is all about self development and motivation. And if you ever are in need of any type of motivation, He's right there to give it to you real talk. He's not gonna sugarcoat it for you. He's gonna give it to you like it is. Definitely go check him out. His channel is amazing. The next channel that I love watching is At Home With Nikki. And so she's got an organizational channel. And so she's literally going around in different rooms in her house and showing you how she organized different rooms or even decorated. And so I love watching her channel. It gives me different tips and tricks that I can use at home. So definitely go check her out. If you enjoy watching organizational videos, she's definitely one to check out. So of course, I'm gonna tell you about my channel as well. So at the very beginning, when I breezed onto the YouTube platform, I started out as a hair and makeup channel. And as the wind was blowing through my hair, I realized I've got so much more content that I want to share with you guys. So now the channel has evolved into a lifestyle channel. And I also talk about YouTube tips as well. So definitely come check me out. I put out videos every week to keep you entertained. Now, story time. One day I decided, you know what, let me just search on YouTube and see what other black YouTubers are saying about their experience on this platform. Okay, we must talk about this. Unfortunately, I've seen so many videos of black YouTubers literally on the verge of tears or saying they're ready to give up, they just had enough and they were so frustrated about not getting seen on the platform or they feel like the algorithm is against them, different things like that. 
So I'm sure you've probably stumbled on a few of those already by now. Now let's talk about exactly why it's so hard to get seen on this platform as a black YouTuber. Well, if we think about where YouTube is located, so YouTube is located in the United States. I believe most YouTuber viewers are actually from the United States. So, so if we break it down and look at the US population currently, okay, we are sitting at 13% of the population. Yes, I said it. So we are only 13% of the US population. So out of the 13% of black people in the United States, how many of those black people are on YouTube and have a YouTube channel? Not as many as we would like. As Bernie Sanders would say, let's be clear. Quite naturally, there's not as many of us on this platform. So that makes people wanting to see a black YouTuber channel have to search so much harder to find them. Now let's dive into this algorithm. What is going on with this algorithm? Is it like people have said, is the algorithm playing against us? Absolutely not. Yes, I know it's difficult to stand out on this platform. However, we cannot blame the YouTube algorithm for our struggles. And here's why. We of course need our allies to watch the content and we need support from our own community. So of course we want more people to click on our content before someone even sees your content. They are only looking at the thumbnail and the title. So quite naturally, we're going to need to raise the game, whether it's better titles, better thumbnails or both. So I think that's something that, Hey, we've got to just stay focused and keep getting better and better. The way I think about it for myself is that I want to get better with each and every video that I put out. And so it's not a competition. So the only person that I feel like I'm in competition with is myself because I'm trying to get better with every video. And when I say support from our own community, here's what I'm talking about. There's so many times where I see this black on black crime where it's just hating in the comments of another fellow black YouTuber. Let me just put this in perspective. If you are a black YouTuber, you clearly know how difficult it is to be on this platform. So why spread any type of negativity? If I make sure that I only leave positive and uplifting comments for not only just black YouTubers, but any YouTuber in general. If you run a YouTube channel, you obviously know how difficult it is to have a successful channel. And you know that there's so much work being put into each and every video and no judgment, but if you are somebody that does the hate comments, just cut it out. Literally just cut it out. This world is tough enough as is, and we definitely just need to support each other instead. And another reason why it's so hard on this platform, it's no different than the outside world. Let's just think about it. whether it's a black celebrity, if you're a black YouTuber, if you're a black small business owner, it's going to be tough for you in any lane. Why? Because we are the minority. You've got to work twice as hard to be able to stand out. So that doesn't say that it's the YouTube platform or with their algorithm working against you. That's just the way it works, unfortunately. And so that's why we need to support, support, support. Another thing that I find very interesting in the black community is that we will definitely come together when it's about racial inequality and things like that. And you'll see everyone come together and unite. But unfortunately, on the other side, when it comes to black small businesses or whether it's even just looking at black YouTubers on the platform, there is not as much support rallied around us in our own community. And why that is, I'm going to let you think about that and you be the judge on that. Which is unlike other cultures who will remain nameless because you know who they are. So let this be the year that we literally band together and help each other out, give support on our channel. And of course it goes without saying, you don't have to be black to support a black YouTuber channel. 
So for those of you who don't have a YouTube channel, I'll explain this to you. It is so important to like videos, comment on videos if you enjoy them, or subscribe to someone's channel. A lot of times people continue to watch your content, but they won't subscribe because they don't understand how important it is to that YouTuber to be able to grow. And so that's super important. If you want to support someone's channel, then go ahead and do that. I love getting uploading comments just because I know it can make someone's day. Um, and I love to share that positivity around. When I think about it, back before I was a YouTuber, you know, I would just continue to watch people's videos. I had no idea what type of effect it had on a channel. And so um, that's why I just want to explain that to you, how it works. Since we're talking about support, if you have the YouTube channel, definitely leave it down in the comments and just leave a brief description of what your channel is about. And you never know how many people may be interested in that type of content that could just quickly go click on your channel as well. So I usually wouldn't say this, but hey, this is a video rallying around support. So why not go ahead and leave your channel in the comments and hopefully someone else will check you out as well. So to anyone that's feeling down about YouTube and you're thinking about quitting or you're just frustrated, I'm here to tell you to keep on going. If this is something that you wanna do, don't let any type of negativity or slow growth get you down. Just keep doing what you love doing and you will get there. If you're not a YouTuber and you've actually made it to the end of this video, definitely just put hashtag support in the comments. Let me know you're here to support. So while we're talking about it, make sure that you hit that subscribe button down below and you turn on the bell for the notifications so you don't miss out on any of the content that I post. Another thing that can help you get viewers is diversifying your content. And what I mean by that is maybe currently you're only focusing your videos on the black experience. And that's certainly fine if that's the only thing that you wanna talk about. So maybe it's just black hair care or, or maybe you've got a channel on single black dads or something like that, whatever it is. So that's certainly fine if that's the route you wanna go. But sometimes, depending on what your channel is about, you can diversify your content. You can make content that other people would enjoy as well, that you wouldn't necessarily have to be black to watch your channel. I'm not saying assimilate, but I'm saying diversify your content. You don't have to change anything about yourself, it's just creating content that more people would be interested in watching. Well y'all, I've rambled enough. I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember, support, support, support. And until next time, I'll see you later.